My name is Louise Kelly Johnson. I'm the director of School Safety Division. I've been on the job now for 37 years, going on 38 years in September. We protect the kids of the city of New York, 1.1 million school children. Do so much when it comes to our kids, keeping them safe, um, being proactive with bullying or, you know, there's just so many different aspects of what school safety does when it comes to kids. We have a motto, each one, save one. There's 5,000 of us. Imagine you save one kid, one kid a year. That's 5,000 kids a year. The impact we have on these children's lives, it's, it's so positive. So yeah, hearing all this stuff that they talk about, uh, we're not cops. If I wanted to be a cop, I would have been that. I turned it down. I turned down court officer. I turned down all of these jobs. This is what I love. You have to love kids. You have to want to do this. Kids can be difficult. They could try your last nerve, okay? They can really take you places you don't want to go. But they can also really bring out the best in who you are. I remember coming up as a school safety agent. It was, it was predominantly male um, throughout the course of my career. Um, and then at some point, the changeover started happening. I think that in a lot of ways, women have a, an ability to deal with kids on a different level. Don't get me wrong, our children, children of color, children, uh, urban, um, need role models, male um, and female, of their own, who, who look like them. Sometimes you can affect them really well. Sometimes you can. Sometimes you can turn them around, especially when, to, when they get to that point where they realize that what they're doing is not taking them in a direction that they want to go and that everything they try to do, they keep ending up in trouble and they don't want that anymore. Those are the kids. You can affect huge change with those kids. It's amazing, the women and the, and the men, the, the, the job and the blood, sweat, and tears that they give to these kids, above and beyond the job. A lot that they do is not on the job with these kids. I used to be the booster, twirler, and cheerleader uh, uh, advisor for Madison High School. I had 150 girls. I took those girls to competition. I took them all over the city. We did the March of Dimes Walkathon. We did, you name it. I had a ball with those kids. I didn't get paid for that. They couldn't find a way. They tried to figure out a way to pay me for that. Didn't matter. They were 150 girls that I affected change for. And I know that. The only reason why I know that is because recently I was on the dais at graduation. And at the end, when I came down, my booster captains were there. I haven't seen these girls in what, 20 years? They're grown women, families of their own, all that. And I, that's when I found out that every one of them were public servants. Every one of them. And, and then they said it was because of me. <laughs> that blew my mind. That was my career, that was my choice. It is the choice of everybody else who has followed me. It was a choice and a conscious decision. This is what I want to do. People say, oh my God, you wanted to do that? Yeah, I did, I do. This is what I do, this is what I love to do. This is what my purpose is. This is what our purpose is.